give your mind a few minutes to settle down. We've been scurrying around all morning. It takes a little while to zero in on the breath. So try to gather all your thoughts, all your awareness, and bring it right here. As for the other things you've been thinking about so far, just let them go for the time being. You don't have to be responsible for them. It may sound irresponsible to do this, but actually when you're meditating it's one of the most responsible things you can do. You're looking after your own mind. You're taking care of your own mind in areas that nobody else can do for you. When you take care of this part of the mind, then you're a lot less of a burden on others as well. A lot less greed, aversion, delusion comes out of your actions. You're a lot stronger when you deal with difficulties in life, when there's pain that comes aging, illness. You've got an inner strength that makes you less of a burden on others. And as you train your mind, you're also providing a good example for other people. So this is one of the most responsible things you can do, looking after your own mind, training your own mind. And this way you find a happiness that goes beyond the ordinary, a happiness that stays with you. And the side effects are that you help other people be happy as well. So as for the thoughts that come in and demand your attention right now, say, not now, not now. You can, we can talk later. We can deal with this later. And if you look at these thoughts, you find that a lot of them really aren't all that important anyhow. And as for the ones that are important, well, of course, they require a mind that's really clear and really mindful, really alert in order to deal with them properly. So again, put them aside for the time being. Say, give me some time to get the mind clear alert, mindful, concentrated, discerning. Then we'll deal with you, even if it's only a matter of five minutes. It, make a, it can make a huge difference. So when people say that meditators are looking out only after themselves, that they're irresponsible, it's really not true. It's, in fact, it's actually the opposite. We're looking after ourselves and other people, and we're being as responsible as we can. So make sure your priorities are straight. Anything that comes in right now and says it's more important, say, not now, not now. The most important thing in, the, in your life is your mind. Make sure that that's always in good shape. And everything else can take a lower priority. And you'll find that when difficulties come, you're glad, you'll be glad that you gave the mind this priority. You gave it this importance, because it's going to be your inner refuge something you can depend on, something other people can lean on as well. So don't let anything else pull you away. <laughs>